Got the spin. Oh, I hate to see this. That's uh, terrifying. It's just really going fast now. Good evening, thanks for joining us. Tonight's big story, the video that everyone is talking about, a woman being airlifted off Piestawa Peak, spinning out of control for several minutes as crews try to rescue her. The video going viral tonight, and it's really hard just to take your eyes off of it. And not to mention what that poor woman in the basket must have been going through. Team 12's Nicole Zymek joins us here in Studio 12A with how something like this could even happen, Nicole. Yeah, that video is just incredible to look at. But mountain rescues in themselves happen all the time. They don't usually spin out of control. Phoenix Fire does admit they do happen, though it's a very rare sight. Oh, got the spin. Frightening moments. Uh, terrifying. Over Piestawa Peak, as a 74-year-old woman spins out of control. That's just really going fast now. The woman falling while hiking, injuring her face and head. Crews airlifting her off the mountain after she had a hard time walking down on her own. At first, everything goes according to plan. So we were doing a rescue, a hoist rescue. Uh, we do a lot of them, uh, and it was a, a normal rescue. But as crews start to lift the basket, she starts to spin, Got the spin. and continues to spin and spin and spin for almost two minutes. Spinning is uh, very rare. The Phoenix Fire Department says in the last six years, they've done a hoist rescue like this 210 times. Of all those rescues, only a handful resulted in spins. Bobby Dubnow in the chopper during the rescue. The main rotor of the helicopter produces like a downdraft. The downdraft creates a cone under the helicopter. Usually, crews can stabilize it. So we have a, a line attached to the basket to help prevent that. Uh, today it didn't. Add to that the perfect storm of ingredients, air temperature, aerodynamics, and... Sometimes, uh, if we're in a canyon, if there's, it's a strong windy day, it'll just, it'll spin on us. Oh, I hate to see this. But crews do train for this, and as alarming as it looks, they assure us the woman inside was safe. We use uh, a very standardized packaging uh, system. She's also inside of a, a Stokes basket within that bag, so she has multiple points of packaging and uh, connections all over her body. And the fire department says that the woman didn't have any injuries from the spinning except from being dizzy and nauseous, which is to be expected. You can go to 12news.com or the 12 News Facebook page to watch those incredible images again and share them with your family and friends. Guys, back over to you.